The spirit is extremely personal. I think that Unitarian people made a mistake when they said that the spirit of God is strictly power. That's just wrong. It's not strictly power. It's the spirit of God or Jesus, very personal, but not a third person. That's a very important thing. Your spirit is you in projection, you as extended outside yourself. The spirit of God is God extending himself through his words, the words of Jesus and so on, through miracles or whatever. But it's very personal. Now the spirit of God is not a third person. That third person never sends any greetings, is never worshipped, and is never prayed to, tell your friends. Where did the Spirit ever send any greetings in the letters? Never. Was the Spirit ever prayed to? No, of course not. Because it's the personal Spirit of God or Jesus, indistinguishably in the New Testament.